How's it going, everybody? Welcome. I'm the Robo Doctor. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and let's get on to the news. All right. Well, we like to, uh, you know, have these Claude keeps winning segments all the time. I just like to show you guys some of the cool things that Claude uh, currently can do. And look at this, guys. Claude 3.5 Sonic creates a fully working ChatGPT clone. Uh, just a, from a screenshot in two minutes, it uses Llama 3 running locally on your computer, 100% free and without the internet. That is freaking awesome. Unwind AI, if you want to go and check out how they did it, go ahead and go over there and uh, it looks like you can get, you know, we're going to be talking about Llama uh, here in just a minute and how uh you know how important and and how uh actually crazy it's gonna start getting now that we have local large language models that you can just run on your computer all by yourself all right luma labs came out with loops in dream machine perfectly looping videos from first frame to last frame create loops in text to video image to video and also extended video available today to everybody so you can make these little cool animations uh that loop uh, your videos, pretty cool. You know, Luma Labs, awesome. I guess, uh, you know, I haven't really done too much of the video. I want the video to be like, uh, you know, it was kind of like how Mid Journey, about what, a year and a half ago, a year ago, uh, was, you know, putting out some, you know, crazy hands and uh, crazy faces and feet and all that. Now it's, uh, you can't, you can't even tell uh, that there's the difference. That's kind of where I want the video to be, to, to uh, mess around with it too much, uh, st to start paying, you know, $10, $15 a month. Cause I've already, you know, I'm already spending $20 on ChatGPT, $20 on uh, Claude and uh, Mid Journey. And it's like, well, I, you know, I probably should cut back a little bit. <laughs> so uh, I haven't done any video cause I don't really have any purpose for video at this point. Some of the stuff that I've done with Luma Labs is, uh, it's all right it's all right so far and uh you know even with runway it's all right uh speaking of another uh ten dollars a month you 11 labs hey they were you know here we go if you got if 11 labs awesome uh you know awesome that what they're doing just saying that it's it's another subscription there's so many subscription based things out there it's kind of getting tiresome i'm guessing some of you guys are feeling the same way you know let me know in the comments if i'm in the wrong uh, but, uh, yeah, I mean, 11 labs came out with their new Android app. So, uh, if you're a, a user of 11 labs, it's on your, uh, and you own an Android, I'm guessing it's already on iOS. So, uh, which is important to me because I am an Android user. And a lot of the times we either get forgotten or we get the stuff at first, but a lot of the, uh, uh, AI stuff for some reason goes to iOS first. So good to see it. Great to see it. All right, big news. This is huge news today. Uh, Redditors leaked the benchmarks of Llama 3.1 405B, uh, Meta's most powerful model to be released tomorrow. It outperforms GPT-40 on many levels. Uh, so this is crazy, guys. Look at ChatGPT-40. I think the only one it doesn't win in is the humanities. No. Oh, okay. No. Yep. It beats it that that one. There's one of them that I saw the. I, I, I'm not gonna look at it right now, but it'll pretty much. Uh, look at all of the even the 70 beat, which this one 405. You're probably not gonna be able to run on your computer. Maybe you know, get your get your laptops out, get your 1995 uh, uh, Windows XP computer out to uh, try to run it. But uh, I think the 70 B and the 8 B for sure. Uh, you know, running them locally and look, they just beat out G Chap GPD 4.0. So this is pretty awesome. This is local. Uh, you can run it on your computer, guys. Just like we saw uh, earlier, where this guy is making a fully functioning uh, ChatGPT clone, uh, just uh, you know from a screenshot in Claude. Now you can have a competing uh, ChatGPT on your computer running locally. Uh, without the internet. So if the internet ever goes down in your house, you have, uh, you know, ChatGPT uh, right at your fingertips using Meta 3.1 uh, Llama. So 405, I'm not entirely sure that you're going to get these uh, results, but at least 70B, I think that you, most people, well, if you got a pretty good graphics card, I've got a 3090, so I'm pretty sure I can run these, but uh, I don't know what the, uh, you know, that, uh, well, we'd have to see. 8B for sure. Most computers, uh, especially with a graphics card, probably run these, uh, but they're, you know, they're below 
uh, the ChatGPT here. If you want to get ChatGPT uh, closeness, I would say the 70B. And uh, apparently, and apparently it's actually already been released. Somebody already put out a, uh, a link on Hugging Face. Uh, looks like there's some torrent files. And so there you guys go. See how big it is. 820 gigabytes. <laughs> So prepared, be prepared to get, uh, you know, your, your ISP calling you, uh, wondering what's going on, uh, why you're, why you're downloading so much from a torrent, uh, but 820 gigs. That's crazy. I want to see how this, uh, how this model actually, uh, works. And then, uh, I might download it myself. You know, I've, al I've always got an extra, extra, uh, SSD lying around and man, and plus hard drives are cheap now and SSD, a one terabyte SSD that you can get, probably put it in an uh, external hard drive case. You can probably get it for like 50 bucks. Uh, so yeah, pretty awesome. I can't wait to see uh, what people come up with this. I might, I might download it myself. I don't know. All right, so here's some of the uh, things that people have come up with. From this, Llama 4 started training in June. Llama 4 will be fully multimodal including audio so multimodal if you didn't know is video audio and pictures even and text-to-speech so uh llama 3 405 will still release in the eu uh so apparently the, in the eu uh they're not going to get llama 4 because of the uh the, some of their some because uh, some of their laws with the uh, consumer uh data so poor poor eu guys llama 4 and beyond will not be released in eu unless they allow meta to use eu facebook and instagram posts as training data so uh there you go you might be uh you know i th th and this is the thing do i agree that your uh post and i haven't posted on facebook in years uh, but do I agree that you should be using people's data to train models? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. What do you guys think? Is it a good idea? I mean, it it's a slippery slope for sure. Uh, you know, especially with YouTube videos, people are going to start using them as uh, how they're training their daddy if they haven't already. So it's kind of, you know, if you're using somebody else's platform, you're sign in that box you're 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 saying i agree and uh, you don't know what you're usually agreeing to right i think that in the end of it it should probably come down to uh instead of all of the legalese garbage that we always see maybe just having what they're actually going to do with it right at first not the legalese right all right last but not least stability ai is actually coming out with a text to audio uh so this is another open model that you guys can download right now uh the model is released under stability ai community license that's that allows non-commercial use and commercial use for individuals or organizations with up to one million dollars in annual revenue so just like stable diffusion 3 uh, as long as you're not making a million dollars over this or or above uh then you don't have to actually do anything with this license it's all free for you to use and uh, i think that that's pretty awesome so it's free uh, why not try it out it's text-to-speech stable audio open runs on consumer grade gpus making it accessible for academic purposes and artistic use cases pretty hard to say stable audio open runs see the model generates variable length stereo audio at 44.1 kilohertz up to 47 seconds uh, so if you guys have tried this, I, I would go out and try it right now. Uh, trained using nearly 500,000 recordings licensed under the, uh, the Creative Commons license, it looks like. And uh, the data set consists of 472,618 recordings from free sound and 13. Okay, so from free music archives. So they're showing you where they got all of their uh, sounds. And so here you go. Users can train the model locally with A6000 GPUs. And I'm guessing any kind of GPUs, but there you guys go. I mean, it's pretty awesome. It's getting crazy because I do like open source stuff. I would rather there be open source uh, models on all this stuff. And it takes a little bit longer than just having a closed source, you know, like ChatGPT. But as somebody said on uh, Twitter today, it's pretty crazy that Llama, who is an open source model, is getting is is overtaking now uh, ChatGPT, who is a closed 
uh, model. So it's it's good to see that open models are actually overtaking them. Finally, you know, I, I, usually you would think that the open model is uh, going to take longer, but not today, not today. So, but that's all I got for you today, guys. I know it's a short one. Uh, hopefully everybody's having a great day. You guys, if you could hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. I will see you guys on Friday and everybody take care. See you guys later.